Hello my friends and welcome to another Tuesday of tutorial. I'm very happy because we are going to draw. <laughs> Today I'm taking on the challenge of drawing a human figure, in this case a ballerina, without using an eraser. I will employ an old technique of pen and ink. Let's see how we fare. As I mentioned, first I'll do a rapid sketch with brush and ink, with this ink pen, which I loaded with a thinned down, diluted version of the fountain pen ink. We can start with the shape of the hair, and this ink is very light. Then the eyebrow, nose, mouth, the eye, and we complete the face with the jaw. This is a different approach than if I were drawing with pencil, because I'm trying not to draw extra lines for guidance, since we cannot erase. Let's do the second arm and the torso. I'm using this brush pen, which has the ink inside, but if you don't have one, you can use a regular brush as well. It is not a problem at all. We draw the leg, and also I give it some shading. First I marked to where the shading is going to get, and then I fill it in. Now the lower part of the leg, and the foot. So the purpose of this uh, first step with the ink is one, to sketch the shape, of course, but also to begin the shading. The shading I do with this will be fairly light. And I'm trying not to get the ink, for now, in the areas of light, of course. The list of materials that I am using, as always, is in the description below the video. And now I will go over with a fountain pen, which has also the ink of color blue in it, but this time not diluted, and therefore a lot darker. And of course the point is very fine and precise. I will not go over all the line, just the things that I want to define or to make stand out. This is a sketch not too much in detail, so I simplify things, like the hand, to a few lines. The masters of the past, which I admire so much, and which I consider my teachers, often used a technique like this for sketching. They used colors more on the brown, and I thought of picking up that technique, but giving it a little bit of a new look with the blue. And let's outline the legs. Like so. It is fairly simple once you have the sketch underneath. And with the pen we can shade using hatching and cross hatching. With this we can get to a much darker value. So we begin to really get some volume here. I love drawing with fountain pens so much. It is such a pleasure. Let's do some more shading. With short lines across the arms and legs. And the cast shadow underneath. I would really love to know if you like this technique and if you want to see more of it. And it's ready! If you enjoyed it, please give it a like, share it to your friends, and subscribe to Fine Art Tips. And I will see you on Tuesday.